Hello everybody, this is Chaos Chunk, and I am going to go ahead and start a video series on how do I start. So this one's going to be called Darkcraft, How Do I Start? This is Darkcraft by Blue Dart, and it is version beta 0.1.20, and I'm currently using it inside the FTB Unleashed Pack version 1.1.4. Now, so this series is going to be how do I start? It's just going to be basic how do I get started because a lot of these mods, it isn't crystal clear on how to start them. So that's what this is about. So how do I start Darkcraft? You should first, you should have a clipboard pretty early on in the game. It just takes some wood, some paper, and a piece, an iron ingot. So this is what I'm going to use throughout this. First thing you do is when you get a force gem, and you get two iron ingots is that you should go ahead and make two force ingots in this com this configuration. If you were to use refined iron there or gold, I think, I, I don't know the other ones, uh, it will actually give you three force ingots. So what you're going to do with these is you're going to make yourself your first force rod. To do that, you're going to go ahead and make some force nuggets. You're going to take one force nugget, place it there. You're going to take just a plain old stick, pop it there. You're going to take a force nut, uh, ingot and pop it there. That will give you your force rod with three durability on it, is what it will do. So we're going to take that force rod, and we're going to use it to make our force tree or our force sapling. Place the sapling in the ground like so. Take your force rod on like so and we have our first force sapling you can then if you wish take your bone meal on it and grow it into a big bad tree the next thing you're going to use your force rod for is you're going to want to make your infuser you place your um, place a piece of obsidian on the ground right click on it and we have our infuser and the very last thing that you're going to be able to use your force rod for is for your upgrade tome notice how my um, my force rod disappeared and turned into a force shard. There's a use for that also in this. You're going to go over here. You're going to take your upgrade tome and pop it in. Notice when I hold shift over top of the upgrade tome, it shows the tier, the number of force points, and number of force points to the next tier. Now, there's several ways that you could upgrade your force tome, but the only use for force shards is this use. You're going to pop a force shard into this spot here. You'll notice that it gives you 1,000 liquid force and 10 force points. So that is how you use your force rod and first get started. Now, another thing that I'm going to show you guys how to do is also you need to um, power your infuser. I do this with a clockwork engine myself. So you take your clockwork engine and you pop it right there. And you know with the clockwork engine you need to go uh, relatively uh, not to not go past red or else it'll blow up I'm getting a lot of lag and I don't know why okay and there's your force engine and that's going to add force power right here okay and as you can see it's building up in MJ's and last but not least I'm going to show you guys how to make force sticks now how you make force sticks is you're going to take your force tree down and I'm using a force mitt here another part of dark craft like so and then you're going to take those force um, logs. You're going to place them in here. You're going to get force planks. You're going to take your force planks, pop them in here, and there's your force sticks. Just that simple. So my name is Chaos Chunk. I hope you enjoyed this video on basic how to start uh, dark craft. Remember that you can find me on... Uh, www.twitch.tv forward slash chaos chunk every single day except for Friday from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time uh, every day. So I look forward to hearing from you all there in the channel and this is Chaos Chunk. We out!